Hedora is one of my favorite kaiju. Uh, as a kid, Godzilla vs. Smog Monster uh, terrified me, but it also made a big impression. And I have a lot of Hedora toys, but this is from Super 7. It's part of the reaction line. This is their reaction Hedora. It's a couple bucks more than your standard reaction. So those usually they're about 20. This one's like 25. And uh, five points of articulation. But this base body, I, th I think, is hollow. Uh, and then you have these uh, kind of softer arms. And I really just love the way that these look. Uh, the legs move a little bit. The tail moves a little bit. So give you your token five points of action. Uh, give you your token five points of articulation. The sculpt is just gorgeous. Hedora is notoriously hard to capture. I think there's so many different ways you could render him. Um, and But this one really, really captures the look. I mean, these eyes are awesome. And I don't have every one of these Godzilla reaction figures, but man, they are good looking. I will say that. I have a few. They're great. Um, I've been kind of not deep diving into the line just because I have, you know, so many other versions of these characters in soft vinyl or whatever. But when Hedora and a Jet Jaguar come along, I have to get them. So here he is. Here is Hedora, the smog monster. There's not a lot to say about him. He's got little holes for a stand, doesn't need him. Uh, but he is a really cool little guy. I'd say 25 bucks is a, a lot. But that's just more about the economy than than this figure in particular. Everything is going up in price, and that's just what you can expect to pay nowadays. So all things considered, it's a really nice figure. I would recommend picking it up. It's Josh from Collection DX. See you next time.